Legend of Total War here with part 41 of my Stainless Steel 6.4 Let's Play campaign as the Quaresmian Empire. On the last episode, I conquered Gaza. That's about it. Now, uh, and took out a few Egyptian, oh, not Egyptian, Fatimid forces. Alright, need to reorganize this shit. Make sure that the Mongols do not pass through my little glitch brigade. How may I serve, Sultan? Naam. Fuck, alright. Put that there. As you will. Draw him out that way. Very good. So we're going to keep on expanding over the over the Fatimids because this area here, if I was to conquer all of this general area, it it's got my back to the wall and there's nobody that's going to attack it without coming through a very small frontier. So it makes it a lot cheaper and easier to defend than, say, if I was to expand out into Europe. Then, the more I go out this way, the bigger my frontier becomes. So let's deal with this first, and then I might even uh, might even go deal with the Mongols soon. Depends how big they are. I don't know how... Well, I suppose I could check. Let's see. Mongols, where are you? There. So their still overall ranking is higher than me, but they have dropped down a bit lately. Their military's dropped off, so they must be losing some battles. I know they lost a two, two against me, yeah. They're still a lot stronger than me, though. Production, they're fucking right down the bottom. Uh, territory, it looks like they're at 16. It's hard to see that fucking yellow line. It's much smaller than me. Their finances are down the fucking window. Population, whatever, that's just not important. Okay, yeah. So, they're not, not that strong. But they've got 16 regions, and that must be all up in the north somewhere. So they they have expanded. That's for fucking sure. All right, what are we gonna do now? Just recruit more units, I think. They still need to invade Cyprus to get rid of the uh, the Crusader states. That's definitely on there on my shit list. Could use a bigger navy. Yeah, whatever. Okay, let's start building. Because we're pretty much at the end of the turn. Kermanshire doesn't have much left to build, and it's close to being able to be upgraded, so that's good. Just build stuff that's going to be quick to, to fix up. Tbilisi. Let's see. Yeah, not really important. Actually, we'll get the Ballista Tower, since it is on the frontier. That way, if the fuckers, Mongol fuckers, do decide to come up against me, I've got a bit more defense against them. Because it's a fortress. That's Sinop, or Sinop, I don't know. Let's see, what do we need? Need a bit of law. Still need money as well. Let's go with that. Kari Syria. Uh, who cares? Oh shit. Again, who really cares? Just go for public uh, population growth. Okay, all good. So it seems like I'm making a fair amount of money per turn now. That's good. Okay then, let's just move on to the next turn. Separating the men, mighty. Separating the men. Hope there wasn't something I forgot to do, because that would piss me off. Right. So they've got fuck tons of units over here. Now, I could fight them, and I possibly could win. However, I do not like to be on the defense, so I'm going to withdraw. Yeah, and I'd prefer back. to be on the attack. That watch patrol. 
We rest here. Infidels wait. Infidels wait. Usual shit over here. We are beaten. We rest here until dawn. Good. Bring them up north. They fight like a cornered snake. Bulba. Took me a while to get them out of here. Continuing tomorrow, That's probably not the last time they're going to send troops down this way either. Or they're going to spawn troops down that way. Plus the Timurids, they're going to show up about there. In about, I don't know, 60 years. But I've got plenty of time to prepare for that. I don't think the Timurids are in anywhere near as much of a threat as the actual Mongols. Yes, we need more generals. No, I do not need that. Actually, let me have a look at the Hashin, Hashishin Guild or whatever it is. Uh, where does it go? Maybe it's under Castle. Where is it? That's interesting, it's not even here. It's not listed. Either that or I'm fucking blind. Ah, oh, right, the Assassin's Guild is called the Hashid, Hashim's... Hashashim's Guild. Right. I actually wouldn't mind that, because it gives 10% law global effect. Shit, next time I get that, I'll actually say yes. And then keep hiring assassins there, even though I'm not going to use them. Just to get the level... Well, just to get the upgraded. Just for law to all regions reduces corruption by a lot. These guys are still so fucking strong. I thought their military rating was weaker than mine. Let's have a look. Yeah, but not by much. This must be the majority of their forces, and I don't think that this guy that is going to be able to take all of this on by himself. It's simply too much. There's like three stacks there. Still, he can give it a go. Worst case scenario is he dies, and he's not that great anyway. What about you, fuckhead? We're gonna kill this army? My I think so. And then we might even be able to head over here. Might even be able to get a false draw out from this. But this has got to go first. We will them There's nothing here of any real concern. It's mostly just spear shit. Alright. Still, my army is very messy. Doesn't matter. Let's go take him down. seem at least reasonably well organized. Fuck, I was meant to select them. Keep these guys together, heavy cav. Them together over here. And let them come. Because they'll come at me. Because I have Archer Superiority. But at the same time, we want to be able to smash right into their flanks as soon as the opportunity is given. Nice, bright, sunny day. That always helps. Those Desert Archers just got raped. Now, 
I want to shoot down their Arab cavalry. That I think is the highest priority. Gotta wait until that red stops flashing. Because otherwise some of the units can't shoot. I know some of them, I could get some of them to do it, but there we go. I'm lazy. They should tear this fucker to pieces. so good. The archers have done a really good job. Okay, pop the crash into them. Don't worry about this. They're already wavering. Those are Saracen militia, they're not, they're not too bad. Come on, kill this fucktard. Well within our grasp. In time, our foe will surely see this and lose heart. It's good. Broke them. And how we go against these ones? Broke them as well. Broke the whole fucking flank. Where's their general? Good. The enemy's general lies dead. Now his men can sense their doom upon them. Battles won. They can't do shit against me now. It's all over. Guys, come on. Get shooting. Only half the enemy force remains. We must pray they lose their will to fight. <laughs> Two percent of my army. Is that all they could do? That's what happens when you don't bring a general in. Go up against me, bitch. Okay, you guys can stop shooting. I'll be causing myself to get 3% here. Yeah, fuck it. Right, that one there's the last to rout. To Allah, you have left our enemy lost. They run like children. Scour them from the field. Too easy. Great victories are like sweet. Only lost nectar. 50 men. Come, shit. Let us drink of the most rare and just a little bit more than 2% of my army dead. Uh, Don't even have to think about that. That's a no brainer. Fucking kill them. Now, I want this city. Now, it's quite possible that there are other armies around here. Now, who will I send to go and get the siege started? Send you. Uh-huh. Yes, mostly them. Yep. Let's reorganize as well. How may I serve? And this is that. Very good. And then I think that's organized. Yep. They'll come back. Yep. Now we fight them. And let 15% or 16% of them go back to the city. Well, we go right outside the city, and then we crush whatever's left behind. Those ballist, uh, those um, trebuchets, they've got to go. They've got to die right the fuck now. Okay. Fucking hilly land. Pisses me off. Coming at this from a bad angle. Still, I'll try just using my cavalry straight away to go and kill that fucking thing. What is it? The trebuchet. Because I don't think they've got any archers, so I should be able to use my guys to lure them down this way. Guys are going to get the 
party started. Oh, whoops. I thought I told them to attack. The fuck? It's with that. It's like I've lost some of the skins to this game. That was happening to me on, um... Westeros Total War, I think I thought it was the uh I thought it was just that mod. Full fights with horns made of clay. It doesn't really matter. As long as the game itself doesn't fucking crash on me like it did before, I'm okay with it. Alright, tear them up. I said they need to die. Pure and simple. Fucking kill them. We're done here. Get back. I hate these fucking stragglers. Why can't they just stay in a proper battalion? Get rid of that. I don't want to kill too much or else I'll have to release them. Actually, releasing five men isn't too bad. If it does come down to that, which it probably won't. Shot to shit. I think I'm gonna have to focus on archers when it comes down to taking on the Mongols. Because their their melee troops will just outclass me no matter what I do. But in a in a firefight, a skirmish, I actually stand somewhat of a chance. Sort of. Depends on the situation. Um, killed 50% of them. The enemy are badly bloodied. They have lost half their men. Behold our worthless foe. See how that general turns tail and flee. Oh. Praise to Allah. You have left our enemy lost. They run like children. Scour Let's them see. from the field. Let's see if we can get to that. 80. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Alright, since we got to past 80 something percent, I'm gonna have to release the troops that I've got. Fuck, fuck, fuck. So let's not capture any more. I said not capture any more, you fuckwit. So that the amount of their. them killed is at a maximum. Good. So essentially we'll be sending 49 back, plus whatever managed to uh, escape. So I want that number to be as small as possible. Which, according to this, is going to be pretty fucking small. At most 100 men are going to survive this. Great victories are like sweet nectar. Yeah. Come, uh, let us drink of the most 80, rare and glorious fruit. That's acceptable. That's actually very good. Although, it does have the trebuchet units in there. But, the next battle's gonna be so small that it doesn't really even matter. Let's release them. They go back to the city, and then of course, the force draw out is done. There, there. And we just need to make sure that he dies. If he dies, I win. Luckily I've got missile cavalry. No mercenaries though. Yes, Sultan. So who is this? Is this the faction leader? No, it's the faction heir. Let's go kill their faction heir then. And take the fucking city for myself. Right, 
right, so heavy cavalry, you guys are going to go take down the remnants of that army. Just, just go straight away, right in their face. Just to put two ballista, hopefully they largely miss before I get there. So far, so good. Don't well think I lost a single man. You have left our enemy lost. All right, you're they run up. like children. Scour them from the field. Actually, you can go first. You'll thin them out. back if you would, which is probably what I should have done in the first place, because they're not really taking much attention to me. Looks like they're going to kill about half of them. That's not too bad. Maybe even more, because they had about 50, I think it was. Yep, they've killed more than half. Only half the enemy force remains. We must pray they lose their will to fight. Good job. All right, now it's your turn. Kick their ass. Yeah, it's not that fucking chase me. Come on. Come on, you dickwit. Actually, no, they're going straight for the front line. Oh, fuck, I didn't realize my archers were up the front. Not that it matters, they're still in skirmish mode. Our enemy flees before us like a herd of goats. Drive them from the battle. Victory is ours. And he's dead. Both and what a well douche. Deserved. I lost two men. That's nothing. Considering they lost a city. Actually, there might be a large town. No. Ah. What's this? Your oh, faith right. and courage have triumphed. Al Akbar, yes, you're mine. Of course, occupy it. Allah I don't want to do any damage Allah. to the city. Allah has granted us victory. The word of the Does provide him with chivalry. I would prefer here. it if it was dreadful, victory. but I would also prefer my cities to be intact. Um. Very good. That's another city for me. One less for them. Order. Now then, what are we going to do about this? Are you a night fighter? Doesn't look like it. I didn't see it. Let me just try to have a look one more time. No. Okay, well if you're not a night fighter, then it's going to be hard for you to fucking take this all down. However, if you strike that there, you'll be in the same position as you were in defense. Except we'll be in, on attack. Plus, let's get ourselves some Quaresmian mercenaries. That'll make a bit of a difference. Okay, so the odds aren't in my favor, but what are we up against? This is just basically shit. That's the only thing I have to be concerned about. And this is basically shit, except for that. So I really think I can take them down. Let's go. We shall not leave any of the infidels alive. To battle! Disorganized fucking army here. All right, so heavy cavalry first, then missile cavalry, then archers. Then skirmishers. Then melee troops. Yeah, that's how I like to organize them. Now, I don't like using groups. Some people like groups, some people don't. I'm one that doesn't. You, 
Sneak in there. Our foe brings more men to the battle. So there's nothing to be concerned about in this first one. I might just send you to go harass them. Especially the cavalry. Okay, these guys need to not be at fire uh, not to be at skirmish mode. Shit. That's embarrassing. Oh fuck, here they come. Still actually I got the better of them in that one. They didn't catch me. Whoops, yeah they did. Oh well. It doesn't really matter. As long as I win and crush them. Which I will. You're shooting at the wrong fucking thing. You should be shooting at the Arab cavalry. Do you mean I can't tell them to run and shoot at a, bit sp a specific target at the same time? Can't do that. It doesn't really work. Come on, move it. Oh, come off it. Move it. Oh, you guys are dumb. You deserve to fucking die. Oh, this is pathetic. Fucking shoot the dick. Well within our grasp. In time, All right, heavy cav. See this and Lord Take Harvey. these fuckers out. Great. All my attention needs to go over here. My micromanage these fucking skirmishes. How are we going? Poorly. I expected better results from this. That was alright. Surely they're gonna break at least. Behold our worthless foe. See how their general turns tail and flees like a whipped dog. How do we go over here? Yeah, we broke them, that's good. Now we'll need to break this. Allah. The enemy's general lies dead. Now his men can sense their doom upon them. Good job. We've got this under control. Very good. You go smash into this fucker over here. You guys can go run them down. All praise to Allah. You have left our enemy lost. They're all on the route. We Very good. Like yeah, don't Sour bloody shoot. Don't waste your ammunition on them. Only half the enemy force remains. We must pray they lose their will to fight. So I lost 11% of my army on that. I don't know if that's really worth it, but... Oh well. I think I can train troops a lot faster than these Fatimid fuckers, so... Whatever. Certainly killed more of them than they did of me. I'm certain of it. Oi! Don't fucking shoot. What's taking you so long? Alright. What's going on over here? Oh, some fuck with over there. Our foe fights with horns made of clay. We are winning the battle! Few more, and then you got to get back to the main line. Actually, no, you don't. Stay back up here, and we'll just wait a minute. Try and take out those catapults. Okay, let's get ready to fire again. Don't worry, we've destroyed 85% of that army. It's dead. Look at that, 872 captured. So what they're going to do is just use their catapults to fuck around. That's fine. We'll send my heavy cavalry to smash their Arab cavalry and their uh, catapults. These guys, they'll come over as well. And uh, smash up this one, hopefully. Although they are a little bit winded, they might get caught.
Zip. What's going on? Come on, surely you guys can beat them. Victory is well within our grasp. In time, our foe will surely see this. Shooting them up, that's good. The desert cavalry. Keep them back. Break and kill this fuckwit. I think that's the general too. Yeah, I think it is. Let's shoot him up. Kill the fucker. There's only 18 of them left. How the hell are they doing that much damage to us? The enemy general is slain. Good. Let's see how these snakes fight without their head. Now bloody will break these catapults. Let's get out of there. Shit, my fucking faction air is getting quite badly damaged. Get out of that. What's this? Arab infantry? Yeah, whatever. Grab my guys. Just move them forward a bit because I think they're in my archer's way. Shooting at them. Yep, go for it. Catapults, come on, hurry up. Victory is well within our grasp. In time, our foe will surely see this. Shit, and lose move it, move it. Ah, sure bloody one charge into them, or to fix them up. This Nubian spearmen, I'm sure they're in the same boat. Only nope. half the enemy force remains. Oh, yes, was much of a charge, though. Get away. Good, they broke. Our four fights with horns made of clay. We are winning the battle. Not much to left to do. That's good, I can relax now pretty much. Get forward a little bit. Shoot him up. Very good. Smash it to them. Very good. You have left our enemy lost. Destroyed like both of their armies, without Scar a doubt. From the field. And I only lost 15% of my army. Actually, probably a lot less than that, because I'll get some recovery. 12%. This is a most crushing victory. Well, that's, you know, if they had lots of, uh, what's it called? Uh, Mamluk archers. Then it would have been a different story, but because all they had was spear infantry, then of course no, I was going to beat them. Do not abandon your honor. Fuck Please. honor. Go fuck yourself. Ah. Piece of shit. Now I wonder, can I take on Kerak with this? Uh, it's a little bit more dangerous. Oh fuck, look at this. Owns great estates. Bent on glory. Second major new victory. Aspiring commander. All pretty good. So what have we got in here? Yeah, it's kind of a better army. I wouldn't really go up against it. 
I don't think. Unless, what we could do is besiege the city so it doesn't actually come up and actually assault it. Because, yeah, I think I could take that on. On an assault. Not so much on a sally out. What kind of guild was here? Nothing. What about here? So I didn't check to destroy it. Nothing. Okay. Who here is really weak? You, you're weak. Even though I just got you. Go besiege that settlement. And we will go fucking kill Captain Abul Ashab. To which he apparently has the greater numbers. But has no good generals and full of fucking shit infantry. Though they do have mangonels. Those need to be taken out right away. They can cause me some serious problems if I keep my units in dense formations. Also, my general can't really participate in this battle because he's only got seven men in, the, in his bodyguard. Let's see, how are we going to do this? Oh, I need to reorganize again. guys. Yep. Try and make use of my missile cav. Use, try and stay back only as a last resort. Doesn't really matter if he dies. But I'd prefer it if he didn't. You guys protect the front line. Alright, off you go. If it, they can just take out those mangonels, then I'll be happy with them. That's all they need to do. Ah, oh, and this guy. Send him in. Aim straight for the mangonels. I don't care if these guys die. they're going to start shooting. If they want to shoot over their own troops, that's fine. But eventually they they might get a hit. They're incredibly inaccurate, but still. Over here, guys. effective at shooting people right in front of them, but whatever. Go put them to death. And these guys here climbing up the hill, they're going to get shot to shit. Don't worry about the ballista. It's nothing to be concerned about. More concerned about their infantry. Keep them exhausted and, and shot to shit. Victory is well Good, within they our broke. Grasp. What about the mangonels? They haven't quite hurt. broken yet, but they will. Or not. Doesn't matter, they're not firing anymore. That's That's the important thing. Yeah. Oh, right. Whoops. Doesn't matter. Like I said, don't care if that guy dies. Need you to shoot them. Crap, what's going on here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get away. Get away. Here. Be very careful. This fucker here. Good. Broke him. Yep, you run away. Not needed anymore. What are you shooting? Yeah, whatever. I haven't killed the enemy general yet, though.
actually, in Desert Cavalry, you might be pretty useful if you can smash right into the back of them here. I know you're Missile Cavalry, but it's better than nothing. Okay, here come the Arab Cavalry again. Gotta fucking shoot them. The enemy general flees like an old woman! Attack! Yeah, just do nothing. Fucking idiots. They just stood there and like, should we shoot them? Uh, gave us an order. Nah, let's just die instead. Fuckheads. Oh well, they still managed to break them. Where are you? Oh yeah, you're in the... Killing the routing units, huh? I'm fine with that. Okay, let's bring him down. Only half the enemy force remains. We must pray they lose their will Shit, to fight. Haven't killed enough of them. To Allah. All right. You have left our enemy lost. They run like children. Start Power capturing. The field. Forget about shooting him. There's plenty to go around. Seventy-three percent. That's good. Stopped. Get in. Get into the fucking thick of it, bitch. Only a thousand captured. That's what I like to see. That's a thousand men that basically did nothing for the enemy. We have more than that now. The whole army is gone. What do you know? I could take them all on with this army. Next turn, I'll be able to besiege that city, or actually, I'll besiege it this turn, and assault it on the next turn. And I'm pretty confident I'll take it quite easily. And even if I lose my entire army in doing so, that's still worth it considering how much they've done. The enemy must curse the day they were born. Let all the. Sometimes I forget this is on the hardest difficulty as well. I hate to think what fucking easy is like. I don't think I'll ever bloody go. Touch easy. No. That's good. How may I serve, Sultan? Third major new victory, good. And we besiege this. None of them shall escape us. To battle. No, we only need one. It's a fort. Oh, two might be okay. Yeah. Let me take this place. And you. We shall end this day in triumph. Hang on, I have an idea. I have an idea. It's dodgy, but I have an idea. My idea is this. Cancel that, because this guy can move. What we'll do is move him over here. Besiege the city. They'll clearly sally out, and I'll be involved. They'll get slaughtered, there's no doubt about that, but it gives me time to get these guys in position, and they'll come at me. And also, I'll have it by next turn. It's dodgy, I did this a lot in my Westeros Total War campaign, because it's a lot quicker than doing an actual assault, and more effective in my opinion. So why not? Anyway, I think I'll end the video here. So I'm now sitting on 38 regions, I think. Yep. Things are looking pretty good, but things can turn badly at any point in time, especially if those Mongols break through. Everything depends on stability. Anyway, like and subscribe, part 42 is next, and don't forget to visit me on Facebook. See you next time. Fuckers.